and today with another network solution, two devices that can work together or completely separated. Here, an access point which will be able to enlarge our wireless connectivity. And right over here, although it looks like, I would say, a switch, at least in size, build quality, in terms of software and feature, it has nothing to do like a switch. Even some managed switches that we have seen, this one has a lot more. And it's able to manage access points. So it has a lot more to offer than we can see right over here, but ultimately to improve our network and the management of our network. Now, if you are managing your network on your Windows 10 or Windows 11 computer, don't forget to check out KeysFan, where you can find budget official OM keys at an affordable price and with coupon code that you can see on screen and down below in the video description, it will get a bit cheaper. So just in case, I will leave the link down below just next to these two ASUS solutions. Now, these two solutions, I would say that the access point is for someone that already has a wired network in place and it just wants to spread and have better signal on the wireless network that already has or it doesn't have so this is a great solution but for those that don't have a wired network at least managed network with security and a lot more features that i will show you on the software side then the asus router will be a great choice now this router doesn't have one thing that this support which is poe so if you go on this route over here i would suggest to take a look not only at this router but i will try to leave a link down below but asus has routers and switches with poe which means that i can with one single cable bring power to the access point and that will give me a lot of freedom and a clean setup in terms of wires the router doesn't have wi-fi on its own but with the software we are able to manage the Wi-Fi connectivity that we have on the access points connected to the router, which is really, really cool. Now, if we look at the access point, it's really simple. It only has two connections at the back. It has one connection for the power input and an Ethernet cable. I have connected both because this router right over here does not have POE. But as I mentioned, if you go this route, I would strongly suggest to take a look at a POE switch or a POE router so that we can have just one single cable. It's ready to be connected on the ceiling. I did it right over here on the office and it was really simple and easy. Don't need to drill anything. It's ready for this kind of ceilings that I've got right over here, which is awesome. And in terms of speeds, I was able to achieve the maximum that I've got from my provider so that you can take a look right over there. And I'm talking about this space right over here, 45 square meters more or less without any issues. But one of the tests that I enjoy doing is just going outside. We have door, we have walls and on a 200 square meters area more or less, we are talking about 20 to 30 linear meters. I was able to achieve about 150 to 200 megabits per second download. So it is a great speed for an access point. And we have seen similar speeds on previous routers from ASUS on the business and even on consumer line. I will leave some links down below so that you can check out and make some comparisons because I've got some detailed videos across a lot of routers that we have seen. Now looking at the router, it's really simple on the outside. We will find right over here the one port and then we have a two combo one and LAN ports and two LAN ports, one USB 3.0 and then right over here on the back we have the DC in and that is it. Build quality, great. We can mount it on a wall as well if we want or we can hide it just under the desk or anywhere that we want. Now, the big difference right over here will be the software. And the software, we will see huge difference, although it looks the same. But if we look, first of all, at the access point software, which is the same, it's the ASUS Expert Wi-Fi. And what we will see right over there, it's that it's much simpler to what we will see just next. I will have the usual options of an access point, network configuration, security, and so on and so forth. But if we remove this and we put the wired router software, which we can manage everything, you will see the difference. Actually, if you take a look at the left side of the screen with the options that we have on the router compared with the access point, it's a lot more. In the settings, we will see a lot of options, including Wi-Fi options, which means that with this router right over here, I will be able to manage all the access points that 
I decide to put in place all the AI mesh devices that I decide to play. So I don't need to configure device by device. I can configure everything right over here without moving. And I can even give access to the person that manages the network to access through this router or to access through any of the access points in the building. So if we are talking about several floors and several divisions and several rooms and so on and so forth if i'm right over here i can manage anything that it's on the other end which is just great so the software is very rich if you want to have a better look once again link down below for a detailed video about the asus expert wi-fi software that we have seen but basically this is a simple solution for those that want a wired connectivity and enrich in terms of security and all the functions that we have seen on the asus expert wi-fi and right over here, if we want to enrich our wireless connectivity, and in this particular case, the cool thing is PoE. Unfortunately, this model right over here doesn't have PoE, so I was not able to put it with only a Ethernet cable. Now, hopefully you've enjoyed this video and hopefully you've enjoyed to know a little bit better about this solution right over here, which can work together or completely separate it. If that was the case, don't forget that usual thumbs up right over there, which is really appreciated on this side of the screen. My name is Roberto George, and as always, I'll see you on the next one.